It's been four years and still no sign of Kyron Horman, the memory of the day still fresh for the little boy's father. I remember the day, I remember being down at the bus stop. I remember driving up to the school like it was yesterday. The seven-year-old disappeared from his Portland Elementary School back in 2010, and the search effort is still on. People even raising money this past weekend in the Rogue Valley, trying to help. Go watch for Kyron! I'm always surprised to see how many people truly love Kyron who don't even know him and haven't met him. Kyron was last seen by his stepmother, Terry Horman. She has not been labeled as a person of interest or suspect. However, Kane Horman says he believes she played a role in Kyron's disappearance. But still, four years later, he hasn't given up hope. I thought that we would have the, had this case resolved and he would be home and we would have been done and moved on uh, a long time ago. Um, that said, we haven't. And uh, I still feel very strongly that he's alive, that he's out there. Karen's mother, Desiree Young, shared her thoughts on Facebook. She writes, quote, I will never give up looking for Kyron. I will never stop. And I promise all of my Kyron supporters, I will find my Kyron. In Medford, Christine Pitawanich, NBC5 News.